Let your first thought of the day be thank you. Simply, thank you. Hello everybody, Mr. Brown here Proclaim Ministries, helping you connect faith and life. Connecting the faith you have with the life you live every day. Uh, do you know the difference between, a, difference between a thermostat and a thermometer? A thermostat basically helps you control the temperature, where a thermometer only tells you what the temperature is. Well, waking up in the morning and saying thank you, or having the first thought of your mind to be thank you, is like a thermostat. It can kind of set the temperature for your day. And I think being able to say thank you, having the awareness to say thank you, God, for this morning, for waking me up. I remember growing up in church and I heard a lot of prayers in church. Because I would just you know, pay attention to what's being what's, what's going on. Now I remember a lot of the older people would pray. They would say, God, thank you for waking me up this morning and starting me on my way. Some would say, God, thank you for waking me up this morning and then closing me in my right mind. I think we had a song like that too. But that is so true to wake up and say, God, thank you for this day. Because I have a tendency to wake up tired grumpy because I didn't get enough sleep. Remember one day I woke up and I didn't get enough sleep that day. I was tired and I wanted to go back to bed. The kids woke me up a few times throughout the night. I just want, all I wanted to do was go back to bed, but I knew I couldn't. I had to go speak an engagement and I had to change my mindset. So I began to think about all the things I get to do today versus what I had to do today. It's just a simple mindset change. But what if I just started my day every day? God, thank you. You woke me up this morning. And, and the beautiful thing about this is if I didn't wake up, I'd be with the Lord. Absent from the body is to be present with the Lord. So it makes me think of this verse. Uh, Psalm 118, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. His love endures forever. Some versions say his mercy endures forever. Some say his steadfast love. But you know what? The verse could have stopped right there for my purposes. Give thanks to the Lord for he is good. Period. God is good. And so I need to sit back and think. When I wake up in the morning, what is my first thought? I hope my first thought isn't about getting on social media or what I have to do and all the, all the tasks in front of me. And that can be, that can crowd my mind. But the first thought, I want to train myself to be thank you. Thank you, God, that you woke me up this morning. Thank you that, that I have life. Thank you that I get to do things. Not that I have to do things, because I ain't got to. God, you don't need me. You can do what you can do without me. But I have the privilege to be able to live and function and breathe and make a difference in the world by your power. And so I have so much to be thankful for. And so I wanna help us as people. I kind of feel like I'm talking to everybody else, telling you what to do, but just sharing this thought that what if every day you woke up and your first thought was, thank you. That would be a great day, a great way to set the temperature for your entire day. Let your first thought of the day be thank you.